Okay, I was playing with a cannonball grip idea. I looked up a few videos on YouTube and then pictures on Google search and then just uh, read a little bit about some ideas about what I could do to make something similar. Um, and they said that you could get your hands on softballs if you wanted to make it homemade. So I have got some used softballs here. I have some strap and I wanted a long piece. Okay, I started out with a short piece that's just black and I didn't feel it was long enough. So it goes from just just where my hand is. It didn't feel long enough. I want to be able to really extend my my hands out. So I uh, cut it in half and then sewed the ends uh, to this blue strap to extend the length, which is kind of nice. But I simply put uh, a, a drill to, through this softball, and it was easy because it's made of cork and tied a knot at the ends. Now, I hung from a rafter holding on to these as best I could. My grip could be better. And these knots do a pretty good job of holding steady. It may have a high wear out value, but it didn't alarm me that they would slip through or that I would be facing any, any pro uh, problems over the next few workouts or so pl playing with this idea. So I'm gonna stick with what I have here, a, can a nice Canon softball grip where I'll use it for rows on, on my suspension trainer and various other uh, exercises using it for um, the upper ground, ground anchor point uh, compared to the ground anchor point, the upper anchor point, just mostly working on shoulders. This will be light duty, these straps our light duty but yeah um, and I was just thinking you, you could possibly put these in a uh, top of a doorway in between uh, uh, the door and the jam and uh, it would hold and then you could just through the have this on the other end and do potentially one-armed uh, types of exercises uh, by just this being held in the door I thought that'd be a neat little idea. Um, and I was just playing around with little ideas. Like, I could have this, the bottom, um, under, under my foot. And you could do kind of some curls with this cannonball idea. It's a different grip. I get a little bored. Use both feet and just curl against it. I get a little bored of the, the the handles, and this offers a, a unique grip for when you're doing rows, possibly push-ups or triceps, but it's just a different way of handling the uh, um, exercise device to give you a different feel, which, which can confuse the... the uh, the muscles, just that the whole muscle confusion thing, uh, that it's not it's not adapted that, to the different uh, equipment, um, and these these are nice and soft too, um, which is very important. That's the argument I make against the cannonballs is that it's metal and it is uncomfortable. Usually metal, when I've worked out at the gym plenty of times, the metal is just too uncomfortable. A lot of people wear gloves, which is, is really a wise decision because I got a lot of um, calluses on my hands that got painful and dry and thick and, and just just break off in large pieces. And I would put up with that a lot in my younger days because <clears throat> I thought I need to toughen them up, need to toughen my hands up. And that's really not necessary. There's, there's enough soft material out there to work with to use uh, and that'll enhance your workout. You can put more muscular force against something if it's softer. So 
these, this is uh, a nice soft uh, alternative to the cannonballs, in my opinion. But I'm just starting out, I don't know what to expect exactly. Uh, I, I just made this, I, I like the feel of it, I just, I hung from it, it's okay. I haven't had a, a good full workout yet, so <clears throat> it's just showing it right now. This may be maybe a five foot length, just so you can get that nice width. This this is just too short. Uh, you don't you don't need a, a heavy duty thing. I was thinking you know maybe you could put a rod through there and and screw a knot at the end. But after putting a knot instead of at the end of a, a strap, it seems good enough, even for my body weight. So I'll just stick with that and see how it works. So um, that's all I gotta say.